been working with Amec for 15 years, I suppose, and it's been remarkable, its um, growth and development over those years. It went from a fairly marginal player in our industry into an absolutely fundamental part of our industry, and that's a testimony to the leadership, both staff and volunteers, um, who've, who've led AMEC and transformed it, and in the process, transformed the PR industry as well, moving it up into more and more strategic work every year. And that's an absolutely critical element of why PRs grow uh, year on year over these past two decades. My first AMEC moment was Barry Legator asking me for lunch and asking for the PRCA to roll in full on with Amex priorities and my answer was an immediate and uh, absolutely overwhelming yes um, and it's been a decade and a half of working together um, since then and the PRCA and ECO's relationship with Amex is the most important one we have by a long way. So I never had to be converted to the benefits of AMEC, it was obvious because the key problem facing the PR industry is talent. It doesn't recruit and retain the very best people. Uh, they leave and go off and do other things. And the reason they do that is they're not paid well enough. And the reason they're not paid well enough is that our industry doesn't charge enough. And the reason it doesn't charge enough is it doesn't prove its value. And that's where I'm at really comes into play because if we can prove the value of what we do we can solve all of those problems we can cut that vicious circle and the the work that eco for example does the annual report we publish says every year talent is the main issue but it also says every year that knowledge of and use of amex principles work and resources increases it says every year that um, evaluation becomes more sophisticated. The hated AVEs are used less and less every year. And that's absolutely integral to the future of the PR industry. And it's an absolute testimony to the work that AMEC has delivered over these years. And that's why, as I've said so many times, PRCA and ECO are, are proud to call AMEC our special relationship by a long way. Amex measurement resources are so important to us as an industry all around the world because they're absolutely vital to moving PR increasingly from being tactical to strategic, to being more respected, to being more frequently represented around boardroom tables and to proving the value of what my industry does. I mean, I, I think the last year and a half, two years, however you define it, of COVID has absolutely proved the critical strategic importance of communications because often there's been nothing apart from comms that organisations have had to offer, whether they're private or public. And proving the value that comms brings is critical. And that's the role that AMEC plays. Looking forward to the next 25 years, the role of AMEC isn't going to be diminished in any way. It's only going to be more and more important. Our industry has resumed growth really rapidly, and it's vital that it continues to invest in evaluation, in measurement, improving the value that it delivers. It still doesn't do enough. And my intention in 25 years, when I'm hopefully, definitely retired, it is that our members in PRC and ECA will be spending an awful lot more on evaluation. They'll be building it into their budgets at the very beginning of the process. And we will have worked together, PRC, ECO, AMEC, to, to make it the norm um, and to embed even more deeply the belief in the importance of measuring the value that you deliver. AMEC has absolutely helped our industry move up the sort of professional services ladder, if you like. It's now a, an, an apex professional service provider. 
And that's because it has proved the value that it delivers. And a key part of proving what it delivers has been using the tools that Amec has provided and having this sort of third party endorsement where in particular agencies can go to clients or in-house directors can go to bosses and say this is the independent measurement of success. These are the standards globally set by Amec, an organisation uh, that we're proud to be associated with. So when the pandemic hit, none of us had any comprehension of how deep and how fundamental and how long it was going to be with us. But right at the beginning, I reached out to friends and partners in the industry because it was clear to me that we all had to work together to get through it. And the first person I reached out to was John Burke as our principal partner and as a personal and professional friend. And we uh, agreed that working together to prove the value our industries deliver was absolutely fundamental to surviving this period. And now we're in a really great place. But having friends like John Ur and Richard Bagnall and Barry and others who you could pick up the phone to and you say, hey, how are things with you? was absolutely critical to me to to getting through these difficult times it's truly delightful to be given that recognition i've always thought of amec as our most valued partner around the world and i've always tried for us both at prc and eco to to do everything we can to support our, our shared goals so this personal award is touching, as I say, humbling and incredibly grateful. And I'd just like to thank the board and the members of AMEC for it.